Hey everybody, this is Cool Impact with Let's Play Roller Coaster Tycoon, and this is um, yeah, look at that October year four. Ha ha ha! You know what? I was at like the basically the win condition, anyways. You know, it would have took forever to get to this point naturally. Showing it all on camera would have been ridiculous. Like, look at how much the park has developed since you guys has left. Like, there's a lot of development if my camera would like to work. And I finally made that stupid water ride pay off. Also, this roller coaster is awesome. Look at this thing. Look at that monstrosity. The 90 degree drop coaster in this park is amazing. I love it. I shoved the park full of rides, put a bunch of rides on the bottom. I made the Chaco Mountain Kart Racing, which is really shitty in the end. That's why I'm not really showing much of it. Other than that first clip I showed in the beginning, I, I, it didn't come out as bad, as good as I wanted it to. When it, like statistics-wise, I, I guess I fucked up. Too many long straights, not enough tur curves. I'm gonna assume. And we've we've got everything made. I paid off the debt. There's 1,455 guests in this park. In this tiny rock, I have shoved that many people. I've shoved all the people in the rock. And, and this. We're pretty much in the gold here. We're in the clear. We're in the set. There's researched basically everything in the game. And once this is done, we can move on to the next scenario. Easy peasy. I know some people might be disappointed. They wanted to probably see the process of how I got to this part of the park. Well, the process mainly is me walking away for about 20 to 30 minutes, getting money, placing one or two rides, walking away again. Buying staff and buying... Uh, new items like stalls and stuff like only occasionally it's it's not even that it was not even that entertaining to be honest I've learned from the earlier videos of the series that it's like I'll have so many so many videos like hundreds of them if I just show everything in the development of a park plus it lags and it takes up space and the time to edit and the time to balance sound levels it's like I really don't have the time to be showing the entire of the thing anymore anyways but here we are victory look at that victory ride I can't get over how fucking awesome that roller coaster is now Ku gets motion sick real easy so he's he's always been skittish roller coasters I go on them once in a while and I get really sick when I do anyways doesn't matter. You gotta live life a little, I mean, even despite the sickness. That's a crawling through your veins. The sickness that's taken over the world. The sickness. That is Plague Incorporated. I actually don't have that game. I only watch people stream it. Seems like it's okay, but it's just, you know, advanced pandemic, and we played pandemic, so, you know. That Let's Play's been done. Check it out on my channel. Play the, the Let's Play of Pandemic 2. There's a lot of weird and obscure Let's Plays that Koo has done, and he didn't even realize he did them until he seen that he had playlists for them on his channel. That's when I sat, th sat there and I was like, when the hell did I Let's Play these games? What? That's that's how much the Alzheimer kicks in when, when you get as old as me, you know. When you stop being young and you get responsibility and life and all kinds of stuff get in the way. Hell, I remember when I started this, I was young as shit. You can tell I was young as shit. Naive in the mind. Can't help that things were a lot different back then anyways. Compared to today's standards, it'll never be the same. And I'm sorry that a lot of people who started doing like things today or started watching things today don't get to have the privilege of being back then. As a uh, so-called veteran, air quotes around that, the veterans of the internet. Man, I remember the days when Newgrounds was the giant place to be. Hell, that was the only place to be half the time. <sighs> Those were the days. I'm sorry I'm being nostalgic. I'm just waiting for this park to end. You know what? Let's play some souvenir stalls to, you know, break up the mood. I got an experiment to do until the park ends. Let's let's place more than one souvenir stall in two different locations in the park and see the different money I can make from the placement of them. Just to, just to see. One at the top, one at the bottom of the rock. Simple, simple. Huh, I mean, I got plenty of guests in this park. Might as well do this. 
Vroom, vroom. Okay, I think the sales have started kicking up. And our total profit is going up. Yeah, no, people are buying. I don't know, it's going up a dollar. Because everything's like two fifty to three free dot three dollars. How the hell have my total profit only nine? Unless only three people bought umbrellas. No, see it went up nine ten eleven two dollars. What? Not two fifty? Wait, what? This one went sick oh, okay. So here's the uh price here's the price range going on here. Let let's let's see who can win. It's a race. It's a race to the end. It's a race to the finish, and there can only be one supremacy in the sou souvenir business. Seems to be that the top of the rock is getting more sales. I guess that, that, that makes a lot of sense, that people aren't taking the under route. Hmm. No more sales? Seriously? Buy stuff. People buy things. Give me more extra money at the end. At the end of the rains. At the end of the day. Wow, that lagged a little bit. Well, whatever the case may be, the top seems to be the top one. Sells more, more sales there, even though the bottom one was catching up somehow. People, stop walking around the, the, the souvenir stall and buy from it. Yay! Congratulations! Thunder Rock is complete! Coup! Ivory Towers doesn't have a coup, it makes me sad. It, it has a blank space. Which is a little bit sad. Uh, don't save just in case the recording gets botched. I won't save until the end. Uh, in Mothwell Mountains it is then, huh? I'm just gonna play them in order. It's the easiest way. Because Rainbow Valley is the hardest. Yeah, I'm gonna play them in order. Mothball Mountain. Ooh, let's make a park success out of this area in the middle of the mountains. This little mountain area. Oh, they're purple. It's weird. The handymen start purple. It's so strange. I wonder why they do that. I wonder why they do that. Okay, let's start building riots. Let's get this shit kicked up. Let's start building profit. Because I've got no money right now. And I got no people in the park. And I gotta delete a lot of trees. Also, the land is like, the terrain is all over the place. It isn't very even. Shit. And that, that's what's gonna make, you know, Rainbow Valley such a pain. You're not allowed to alter the land there or delete the trees. Yeah. That's going to be a tough one. But for now, I can delete the trees and make room for rides. And it seems like the best ride to put in is this Raging Rocket roller coaster. It made me so much money last park. You don't even know. Because everyone came in the park and they're all like, We're going to ride the roller coaster and we're going to ride the roller coaster. 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 They literally were just like that. Climbing up the, the entire rock saying that. Because it takes forever to get up to the top of Thunder Rock in real life. Oh man, they need to spend money right away on landscaping. Oh, it still doesn't fit. Seriously? Can I build Crazy Caterpillar? Will that fit better? Is that the problem? I'm wasting time here. You're wasting my time. I need to get this done. This is some serious, serious, serious affairs. Due to the nefarious and no, no ne'er dwells of the future. Time crimes everywhere. Okay, Crazy Caterpillar, please work. Raging Rocket, please work. Raging Rocket. Red Rocket. Okay, I can place Crazy Caterpillar, apparently. Perfect. Some kind of money source because rides. I don't have enough, I don't have enough money, man. I've got this money shit going in. And I need to open up the park. I need to hurry up and make payment. Got March year one. I only got until year three this time to actually get people going in this place. So I need to I need to really start ranking in the rides and uh, this park isn't very big. I hope there's land to buy. No, I can guarantee there's land to buy in this park. It's gonna be the only way. It's gonna be the only way, man. 
I bet it's expensive. Probably 90 a pop. I'll go check that out in a future video. Show you guys how much land is for buy. Probably buy some land. Maybe at that point we can buy some good land. Woo, okay, that's good enough. Good enough, good enough. Open up rides, open up rides, open up the two rides we have. Get a, get a gentle ride in there while, they're, while people are distracted. Also, I need to start building these from the start. The get-go. Information kiosk right there, perfectly placed. Bathroom. It's more important than the food and drink, in my opinion, is to have a bathroom. I don't know about you, but hunger and thirst I can live through. Then again, technically, if I'm hungry and thirsty, then I don't normally need to go to the bathroom. So yeah, it all depends. But then again, then it's second time again here. Freaking people have to walk to my park. Alongside a highway. This is brutal on their feet, because I don't have a parking lot. I don't know whose idea was to buy this land and, you know, build a park here. Owner of the coup impact. Oh, oh. Oh, I guess it, I guess it was my idea, but I didn't. I don't know what made this such a good idea. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, everything was all lined up perfectly. I didn't. I didn't know that. Damn it, game! You and your perspective. I could rotate the camera and make things easier. Is this line good enough? Whose line is it, anyways? Boom. Clearly, it's your line. Haunted house. So now we have the haunted house in place, and I'm going to start kicking up the admission to actually be an admission so we can start making money, because, wow, I don't really have any cash to do anything. And I only have two guests in the park. Oh, boy. This is actually going to be tough. This is going to be tough as nails. That's not the right height. It ain't connecting to the... That's not connected to the thing, is it? No, it's not connected to the thing. That's connected. I better throw some other staff in here. I forgot to do that. I got distracted. I can't get distracted too much, you know? Otherwise, the park's already going to go downhill. We, we, we've got the good starts going on. we got a good start going on. Hopefully, hopefully my rating won't stay this low for too long. People, why the hell do you not want to ride the rides? Do you like only like low rides? Jeez, it takes forever for you guys to walk to the park up this road. Wow, getting the Mothball Mountain is hard. It's a trek, all right. Oh, hey, look, seven people. Finally, guests. Welcome, welcome. It took you a little while to arrive. I was worried. Good thing I'm researching thrill rides off the bat. Can I put mini cars in? Can I put mini cars in and not get in the red? Damn it, I can't construct there. You cannot construct this here. This is the whole problem I'm having with this park. Pre constructed rides aren't fitting in. What am I supposed to do about this? Uh There's not a lot of room. Wow, the park just ends over there. Oh, hey, there are people on that roller coaster. Good job. Like I said, roller coasters make a lot of money in Roller Coaster Tycoon. Get it? It's Roller Coaster Tycoon. Roller coasters, of course, are going to make a lot of money. Oh, it's raining already. I hope I make some money off umbrellas. Desperate for cash. Drowning and starving. Maybe I should make a boat higher. Those tend to go downhill really fast, though. Like... People want to ride them all the time, but no one can ever make it back to the boat hire. I don't know how to describe it better than that. Heaven or hell, let's rock. So how are you guys doing? I got go-karts. Shit, should I build more go-karts? Probably. So we're going to try to build some more custom go-kart tracks next time. That's going to be a thing indefinitely. First, got to get cash. i got to get some cash before I get some carts. Clearly. Man, I'm running out of time fast. I want to finish the ride entrance. I want to do it. Do it. Do it now. Build the ride. Connect it in. Let people on. 
Welcome to the park. Terminator. Terminator. I really can't do it. Really can't put the accent. Well, I'm out of time, so this has been Coup Impact with Let's Play Roller Coaster Tycoon. Don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment. Next time, we are going to be building up Mothball Mountain some more, getting some groundwork of the park laid out, maybe buying some land if I can get some cash. I'm definitely building some fry stalls, though. Need some french fries. Yum, yum. We're going to be doing a lot of things because this is a new park, fresh start. No nothing can stop us now. It's, it's all in the wind of tomorrow. Well, we'll see you guys all next time. I swear if this coaster blows up, out of nowhere, spontaneous explosion, we are screwed. Park over.